Hey everybody, I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy and this is your kickboxing sweat workout. This is day 14 of your Body Fit Strong Challenge. We are gonna use kickboxing and cardio boxing inspired moves in a format where we progress our intensity. We'll have 45 seconds of a base level, 45 seconds of a cardio round, and then 30 seconds of your sweat round where you really go for it hit style. Don't worry, I'm gonna give you lots of options. You can always stay with level one or level two, and we will all get our heart rates up together. Are you ready? Let's do it. Let's start just by getting our bodies warm. So you can march it, you can jog it, whatever feels good for you. Roll those shoulders to the back. Start small, then take them a little bit bigger. And then let's take them to the front. Little bit bigger here. We are gonna keep the warm up short so we can keep the workout short. So of course, if you need more movement prep, more of a warm up, please get it on your own. You can check out the links in the description to find my extended warm up and extended cool down. Here today, we are just gonna get a few minutes of workouts to get the muscles warm few minutes of warm up, I should say, to get the muscles warm. That's where my brain is today. Maybe you can relate. Uh, but we will get the muscles warm, get our body moving in the movements that we're going to be doing in this workout. So we'll do a few little warm up punches and kicks. Reach it up, reach it down, all the way down and up. Little hinge right here. And then let's take it with just a hinge. Reach down and a squat. Drop it here, reach it down, and a squat. We're gonna keep all of this workout from a standing position. One little part in our last move where we'll add in some core, but you'll have options. Otherwise, standing and essentially no repeat. Let's tap it out and reach across. No repeat, except that we're gonna build each move. So we are going to start with what we call your base level move. So that is your lower impact. That's where you really get a feel for your form. We'll have 45 seconds of that. Then a quick 15 seconds of rest, and we will take it to the cardio version of the move. So where we up the intensity, maybe we change it up or add something on just to get your heart pumping a little bit harder. That will be 45 seconds. And then your last round is what we call your sweat round. So again, building as we go, that sweat round is only 30 seconds, and that is where we really get that heart pumping, really go for it, because after that you get a 30 second rest. So that is our hit interval. So we're building as we go. You can always stay with that base level. Let's take it just to a little boxer shuffle. Stay in front, and just some warm up, little jabs. Guard is up right here. So we're jab, jab, just like this. So you always have the option to stay with the base level or the cardio level, but I really want you to go for it intensity-wise on that sweat round, because you get a little longer break, and then we'll keep it moving. Let's take it uppers, uppers, right here. So on these punches, again, I think I want you to think about keeping your core in tight. We're staying facing forward, but we will do some things orthodox and south call, so right and left. Let's take it hooks, hooks, right here. So in those instances, we'll do half of the circuit on the right, half of the circuit on the left. We'll switch at the halfway point and I'll cue you. Don't let it get too confusing. You can keep it forward if you want as well. Let's go squat, bring that knee up. Squat, bring that knee up. We're still just warming up. Pull it through, little kick. You don't have to get high, but pull through. Yes, you can. Good. Let's take it to the side, squat, little lift, yes, kick it here, pull it through, four, three, two, one. All right, so boxer shuffle, you can always come back to it. We're gonna angle our bodies, orthodox or southpaw, doesn't matter. We're starting with just our jabs, half of this 45 second interval is this way, then we turn it. Join me here, here we go, jabs, one and two. One and two. This first round, base level. So at the halfway mark, about 20, 22 seconds, for being specific, we'll turn it around with our punches 
and we'll get that other side. So punch, punch, little pivot of your knees and your hips. I want you to move it, punch it to the other side. Punch, punch, here to here. So we'll move into it. You got about 10 seconds to go. You don't have to be fast. You can be have a different pace than me. Four, three, two, good. And breathe. So you got 15 seconds to breathe. Next round will be here and then here. We're gonna take it a little quicker. So we're gonna punch, 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 punch. You decide what that looks like for you and then we'll switch it halfway. Cardio round, here we go. Jab, jab, shh, shh, hup, hup. We're just here to here. Keep it going. Little twist to that core. Pick up your feet a little quicker. Just like this, if you wanna keep just that base level, that works too. Three, two, one. Other side, here we go. Jab, jab. Always pulling back, protecting your face, right? Little quicker here. This is where heart rate gets up, but we're keeping that core going, right? 10 seconds. Keep it going. Should feel that heart rate up. Three, two, one, and breathe. There's that heart pumping. All right, sweat round. We only have 30 seconds, 15 seconds each side, but it's gonna look different. We're gonna go corner to corner. One jab, just like that. Then we'll switch it, other side. Here we go, 15 and 15. 30 second sweat round. Pick up that pace if you can. Little jump if you want, but if you wanna keep it low impact, you're just here. Three, two, one. Other side, here we go, get set up. Punch it strong, punch, punch. This is it team, 10 seconds. Then we get a longer breather. So stay with me, three, two, one, and relax. So that's what it looks like. We are building, either increasing in speed, grab some water if you need it, increasing in speed, adding on to the exercise or changing it up like we did in that third round. So we keep it moving, we keep it interesting, a little different for your body, but building up that base level. All right, so we're taking it here, we're gonna go uppers. We're gonna start angled, same thing. Then we'll add on, go ahead and bring it here. Guard is up, uppercut. So we got our three and our four. Three, four, hup, hup. So watch me in those uppers. I'm still pivoting on my knees and my hips. I'm coming up and under, out in front of my body, but I'm still protecting my face. Up, up, take it slow and control. This is your round. Turn it with your feet where you really master that form. Here we go. Take it up, up. From the hip, out in front of your body, but back close again. We're always protecting that face, right? 10 seconds. Breathe for three, two, one. Relax. All right, so just like our jabs, we're just gonna pick it up. Upper, 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 upper. You decide what pacing you wanna get. At the halfway point, we're gonna switch it. So core in tight, guard is up, quick uppers. Here we go, upper, upper. Nice and tight, still not jumping. We're still keeping it low impact. That's what I love about kickboxing is that we can keep a lot of it low impact, but really increase that intensity, just like we're doing here. And breathe, three, two, one. Other side, quick uppers, upper, upper. When we take it to that sweat round, we're gonna really go quick uppers, quick feet. And I'm gonna give you some options. Whew, 10 seconds. If you need to be base level, that works too. What I like about this workout is it's not a flow, right? So we can have intervals, three, two, one, relax. Sometimes it's easier than having to keep going through it. All right, here's your sweat round. We got 30 seconds. Quick uppers, quick feet. We're gonna go four, three, two, touch down. Four, three, two, here we go. Four, three, two, and down. Quick feet, quick uppers, and down. You can also just keep it here, and down. Low impact, this works too, right? Four, three, 
two, and down. Four, three, two, 10 seconds. Keep them going. Quick and down. Breathe. Last one. Four, three, two. Yes. Ha. Ah, now you get that breather. <laughs> Excuse me. Remember, in these intervals, we really want to go for it because you know you have that longer break right after round three, sweat round. All right, team, we're gonna take it to some kicks. You catch your breath, keep that boxer shuffle if you want. You can always keep that boxer shuffle. We're gonna take it to a squat. Bring that knee up in that chamber position. Then we take it to a kick, then we alternate our kicks. In three, two, catch your breath. Here we go. Down, bring it up, down, and up. So try to sit low in that squat and listen. Maybe you're sore from yesterday's workout. Maybe you did a strength workout yesterday. If you're following my calendar, you probably did. So you can not go as low. If you wanna keep it more cardio, take it here. But if you can, know we're gonna get that mobility work by getting low and getting those knees open. So down, pull through. Watch my hip. I'm bringing it forward and breathe. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. All right, team, now we're gonna keep that squat. We're gonna keep that chamber. We're gonna kick it out. You have two options. You can do that pull through, that pointed kick, or you can push forward. So you can have a push kick, pointed kick. Doesn't matter to me, but let's get it done. Here we go. Squat, kick, squat, kick, or squat, Push it forward, as in you're pushing your opponent away. Up to you, we're gonna keep that guard up. We're gonna pull it in. Take your time, does not have to be fast and does not have to be high. Your kick can be here, or your kick can be here. Whatever is good for you, breathe into it, pull it through. I know those legs are feeling it, again, especially if you did that strength workout yesterday, but you're working through that soreness, so let's get it done. And breathe. I'm just angled a bit so you can see me and see where that kick is going, lifting from the hips first and breathe. But you don't have to be angled unless you want to. All right, last round, sweat round. We got 30 seconds of just our kicks. Pull through, pull through, pull through, or push kick. Whatever you got, here we go. 30 seconds, pull, hup, hup. I know, again, it can be low, it can be slow. Whatever gets you good form and good intention. Intention equals intensity. Let's get it done. 10 seconds. Pull it through. Pull it through. Or push kick. Push. Yes. Five, four, three, two, and breathe. Yes, team. Woo! Working our way down this list. Catch your breath, water if you need it. All right, watch me team, we're gonna angle again. We got a half and half. We're gonna go jab, jab, hook, through here, hook. Halfway through, we'll take it other side, jab, jab, hook. Then we're gonna take it with a little quick feet and a little bob and weave. Then we'll up the intensity. Go ahead and angle it. Guard is up, jab, jab, hook, here we go. Jab, jab, hook, core and tight, jab. Jab, and breathe. Jab, jab, hook. Yes, you can. Hook, bring it around. So that hook punch is coming around, right? Hook, hook, scoop it. Hook, hook, elbow up. Turn yourself, other side. Here we go. Jab, jab, hook. Jab, jab, hook. Yes, breathe. Jab, jab. Hook, keep it going. Hook, you can go slower than me if you want. Hook, scoop it around. That hook, elbow up, right? Last one, breathe. All right, so that was your base level. I know it felt a little quick. Let's add a little bob and weave so we're alternating right and left. Jab, jab, hook, bob and weave. Turn it, bob and weave. Jab, jab, hook, bob and weave. Here we go. Jab, jab, hook, bob and weave. Bob and weave. You can keep that jab stationary. Watch me. Jab, jab, hook. Bob and weave, bob and weave. Or move it, hook. 
and move it back. Move it up and back. Up, hook, and back. Or stationary. Jab, jab, hook. Bob and weave. Turn it. Jab, jab, hook. Keep it going. If that feels like too much for your brain, you just keep those punches. Jab, jab, hook. Yes. One more. Hook. Yes. And breathe. All right, team. So let's up the ante a little bit. You can keep it right there or take it. Jab, jab, hook. Jack, jack. Instead of your bob and weave, it's a jack this way, jack this way. Or bob and weave, low impact. Here we go. 30. Jab, jab, hook. Jack, jack, jab, jab, hook, 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 turn it, turn it. You can also keep that bob and weave, right? Jab, jab, hook, bob and weave, bob and weave, or jab, jab, hook, jack. Yes, you can. One more, here, finish it. Woo. Yes, breathe, grab some water. How we feeling, team? We're making our way through this workout. We're about halfway there. Let's take it back some, to some kicks. How about it? Woo! All right, team. So we're here. We're gonna take a side kick, half and half. So we're here, kick. You, again, can lift from the hip, little side chamber, point it out, point kick, or push kick. Here we go. So kick it. Pull it through. I like to pull it through and use those arms, right? Push. You can take it high. You can keep it low. You can balance if you need to to really get that oblique. Whoo! Yes, you can. Stay here. Get the feel for that form. Other side. You can just take it here, take it here. Remember, lift the hip first. Pull through. Pull through. Push kick, you're pushing away. You're still lifting from the hip, but then push that heel towards the wall, right? Breathe. Five seconds. Woo. Three, two, one. Relax. All right, team, let's keep it going. All right, now we're gonna add a little cross punch. So we've got our kick, we've got our cross, we've got our kick, we've got our cross, which is a jab from the back, right? Halfway each side, here we go. Kick, cross, little cardio, kick, cross, pull through, and punch it strong. And up, yes, breathe. If you wanna pick up that pace, you can. And punch, yes, good. Woo. Get a feel for the rhythm, just in time for me to change it up right here. Here we go. So cross and kick, or kick and cross. Whatever is better for you. What were you doing before? Take it through. Punch. Keep that guard up. Take it here. Yes, you can. And breathe. Yes, breathe. All right, team. Sweat round. Here's what we're doing. We're actually taking the kick out of it. We're gonna go cross, knee, cross, knee. Because we can get a little quicker, add that intensity. You can go low impact. You can jump it high, but we got 15 seconds, 15 seconds. Here we go, sweat round, cross, knee, cross, knee, low impact, you're just here. Pick up that intensity in whatever way is good for you. Get low, get high, yes. Other side, here we go, cross and knee. You do not have to go as fast as me. Whatever is good for you. Keep it moving. Five seconds, earn that rest, it's coming. Three, two, one, yes. Ah, I say earn that rest, but you don't have to earn anything here, guys. Look, you earned it just by showing up. Did I remind you that you're successful just by showing up here today? I hope you know that. You show up, you're successful. All right, team, woo, ice. <laughs> I didn't mean to get that. All right, we're going up, down. Up, down with the jab, toes out. <laughs> Take it here, here we go. Up, down, start slow. It's a little half plie, right? So you can come up on those toes. Up, down, up, down. Guard is up right here. 
Core is tight. Jab, high, jab, low. Jab, high, jab, low. Right. Three, two, one. Other side right here. Jab, jab. Start slow. You can even take the plie out of it if your legs are really feeling it from those kicks. Up, up, up. Jab, high, jab, low. Jab, high, jab, low. Don't lose your intensity on that low punch, right? Yes, three, two, one. Good, all right, let's add a hook to it. So watch me here. Jab, 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 hook, hook. And then we'll take it other side. Come up strong on that hook, turn into it. Core is zipped, navel to spine. Here we go, three jabs. Jab, 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 hook, hook. Get low, get high. Yes, breathe, Woo. Jab, 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 hook. Strong hook, remember, turn into it, core. That's your knockout punch, right? We got three, two, one, hook. Last one right here, other side, get set up. Give yourself a second, here we go. Three, two, one. I know we're transitioning quickly, right side to left side. Give yourself a second, you don't have to go right back into it. I want you to feel in control and feel like you have that good form. And if you need to take a breath, take a breath, here we go. Three, two, one, hook. Yes, and breathe. All right, so we got 30 seconds, 15, 15 each side. Here's what we got. You may already be doing it up on those toes with the hook, or it's a little jump. Three, two, one, jump. You got it, ready. Swap round, here we go. Three, two, one, jump. If you want, jump is optional. Three, two, one, hook. Toes, yes. You can switch it. Other side, here we go. Jab, 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 hook. Jab, 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 hook with or without that jump. Shh, shh, huh. Woo, jab, 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 I'm forgetting the middle one. You got it, three, two, one. Yes. How are we doing, team? Woo, I know. Let's take it here. Catch your breath, water if you need it. I'm gonna grab some ice, so I'm not gonna have my water right now. We're gonna go speed bag. It's right here, three, two, one, cross, then other side. Three, two, one, cross. Let's get it going, right and left. Slow, it's a double step. Core engaged, guard is up. Speed bag, one side, here we go. Three, two, one, and cross. Three, two, one, and cross. Hup, hup, and cross. Hup, good. You can pick up your pace if you want but we're gonna take it to that shuffle in that next round. So I really want you to use this round to get those strong punches. I know the speed bag is sometimes a little easier where you can go quicker, but think about keeping it up, rolling through it, and then strong cross punch. You got 15 seconds here. Three, two, one, cross. Three, two, one, hook. Yes, three, two, one. Team, let's do it. Yes, last one, ha, ah, breathe. All right, so now you can keep it right there or take it to a shuffle, cardio round. Three, two, one, ha, huh. three, two, one, cross. Let's get it done, stay low, athletic stance, a little quicker, here we go, shuffle. Three, two, one, ha, huh. huh. Even though we're going quicker with our feet, we're keeping those punches strong. That's one of the reasons we have that base round, right? So we don't lose sight of this, right? We're not just going all over the place. We're really keeping that strong punch. Your shuffle can be slower than mine or faster than mine, or it can just be a step. It is up to you, but we got 15 seconds. Stay low and strong. You know I like to make sound effects on my boxing. Turn that knee and the hip on that cross. Three, two, one, cross. Yes, you can, last one. Ha. Ah. All right, team, it's gonna be so much fun. Let's get to it. Sweat round. Everything you just did, but after you do that cross, you're gonna pop it back, pop it up, if you want. If you wanna keep it regular, keep it regular. Here we go, 30 seconds. Three, two, one, cross. Pop it back, pop it in. Three, two, one, cross. It does not have to be a full burpee unless you want it to be. If you wanna go all the way down, 
all the way up. You can get set. Three, two, one, hop. Pop it back, pop it in. If you're not feeling, just tap it back or just take it out. Three, two, one, hop. Five seconds, no less. Three, two, one. Yes. Ha! Ah, water. One more round, team. One more round. You got it. Ha! Ah, almost done. All right, team. So we got just your basic jack, right? So we're gonna go low impact here to here. Then we're going jack and jab, jack and jab. Then you have the option to take it down for a little core, jack and jab from the bottom, but it's up to you. Here we go. Take it out. I really want everybody, if it's good for you, to keep this low impact and really focus on your form, right? I know you may be wanting to keep it going because we're almost done, but form intention strong arms athletic stance open up those hips can you take it slower and low impact to get better form sometimes that is what we have to do right the difference between this and this right so let's keep it here for 10 more seconds you can have a little hop if you want and then we're adding a jab and we're going to finish it out strong for three two and one ha ah. all right team so let's take it here we're gonna go jack and jab jack and jab low impact jack jab jack jab join me 45 seconds here we go huh. and out now you can increase that intensity that impact if that's good for you but you do you remember i will always tell you to be where you are today. That's gonna look different day to day. That's gonna look different depending on your fitness level. Maybe you didn't get a lot of sleep last night. That's me. Whew, those kids, man, they never let me sleep. So there are many reasons you might take a modification or you might do something differently, but you're here, you showed up. That is all that matters. I know this one's long, five, four, Three, two, one, burn. All right, team, right? That felt like it should have been a sweat round, but that's why we saved it till the end. Let's take it down. We have 30 seconds and 30 seconds is it. On your elbows or hands, watch me here. You're gonna jump it out, punch, jump it out, punch, or if you'd rather be here, it's up to you. Elbow plank or hand plank. I know we went a little over our rest time, but that's okay, we needed it. If you wanna keep it standing, especially if you're in my prenatal crowd, keep it standing or early post. Otherwise, join me here, 30 seconds is all we need to be done with this workout. Bring it up in three, two, jack and jab, high or low, jack, jab, jack. Just wanted to give you a little extra core if that's your thing today. Again, you can be here. Out and in, woo! Yes, team, 15 seconds. Up to you, whatever feels better. Or high, jack, jab, jack, ha! We got five, punch it strong, three, one, ha! Stretch and relax. I really didn't mean to count five, three, one, but it just came out, and sometimes <laughs> Hold it here, stretch it back. If you're up top, I want you just to stretch, bend it over. Otherwise, everybody else make your way up onto your feet. Whew, you did it. Take it right here, round it through. Roll through cat to cow. If you wanna keep that on the floor, you can. Whew. Yes, team. How do you feel? Hopefully you feel good. My goal with this workout, and I have a cardio sweat as well, as well as some other strength sweat oh, workouts is like so many of my workouts, you can build the intensity. So that way, again, be where you are today. You might need to stay with that first level for a variety of reasons. You might need to have that first level on that second level so you can get the rhythm, you can get the feel for what your body is doing. Take it out right here. Roll those shoulders as you tap those heels. I like to build it in a lot of these workouts so you don't feel like you're going in blindly, right? You can 
get it in your body, then you can up that intensity, and then you can get a true HIIT workout, right? Where you really do have that shorter interval that's higher intensity, which does not have to mean high impact, high impact, high intensity doesn't have to mean high impact. So, but you have that option to really go for it. Get the longer rest, learn your next move, keep it moving. We did our regular intervals, but we didn't take any long breaks in this. I wanted you to get it done fast, right? And hopefully you feel that. Ah, oh, let me know in the comments if you like this workout. My other hope with workouts like this is people who don't like the traditional kickboxing flow that's just one thing to the next, da, 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 that when we do intervals with our kickboxing, take the palm to the back, one foot up, that when we do those intervals, it can feel more like an interval or a circuit workout, right? Where you don't feel like you only have to think about one thing for that circuit, not what are we gonna add to make a crazy combo. If you're into those crazy combos of kickboxing workouts, make sure you check out all of my other ones because I do love that too. But I know sometimes I get feedback, people who don't love kickboxing because you feel uncoordinated. Guess what? We all feel uncoordinated. And the most important thing is that we're moving our body. Stay safe, keep moving, show up, keep moving. That is what it is about. Please make sure that you get more of a stretch on your own, roll through those wrists and those elbows, stretch it up, take it over. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. When you subscribe to my channel, you help me keep making these free videos for you. So hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications so you always know when something's coming up. And of course, share with your friends. All of that helps me out. I wanna keep cranking out these videos for you here on the channel. Uh, let me know what you thought in the comments. And of course, if you're looking for more support, and accountability, more guidance on your journey. If you want more nutrition, if you want access to our dietitian as well as to me, check out the Body Fit Athletic Club. And of course, follow me on social at Body Fit by Amy. Woo! Big, deep breath in and out. You did it. That was your kickboxing sweat workout. Great job, everybody.